welcome to the class before start the lesson i want to tell you one incident from that you come to know what we are going to learn today okay let's start just imagine yourself you are traveling in bus while traveling during turning your body automatically tends to bend opposite of the turning are you realize that yes here in turning the bus tends to turn towards the turning but you bend opposite to that turning is it correct yes here two type of force act they are centripetal force and centrifugal force in today's class we are going to learn about what is centripetal force and centrifugal force and then centripetal acceleration let us see one by one first centripetal force just imagine a circular motion for example one man walking in a circular path or a car is moving in circular path if we want to continue in circular motion the car or man excrete the force towards the center that force compel the body to move in circular motion this force is called centripetal force next centripetal acceleration in circular motion the body experience the centripetal force fc towards the center this centripetal force apply centripetal acceleration in the body centripetal acceleration denoted by ac the formula for centripetal force f equal to m a by applying centripetal acceleration the force changed as f equal to m v square by r next what is a centrifugal force let consider a car is moving along a curved road the car produce centripetal force towards the center at the same time the passenger inside the car experienced outside force that force is known as centrifugal force so the centripetal force is a force act on a body moving in a circular path and directed towards the center and centrifugal force is force act on a body moving in a circular path and directed away from the center let us recall today's class the centripetal force is a force act on towards the center whereas the centrifugal force is a force act away from the center thank you students